All right, so it's 2.30 in the morning. Um, I'm getting ready to leave. I'm gonna leave about 3.30, getting ready. Got about an hour, 45 minute drive. We're heading to the Susquehanna today. In today's video, I am with Jimmy from Dam River Boys, and we're going live. We're actually live, but we're up on the Susquehanna, and we got one blue cat, about 16 pounds in the boat, and we're trying to catch more. One chat, channel cat, but stay tuned. Oh, show me what you're doing. All right. So we got a ragger float up here, foam float. We're running at about seven feet. Swivel. Freaking what size number, hook's that? Number, that's a uh, eight there. Eight? Eight circle yeah. hook. Hey, don't be scared, speak. Yep. Don't be scared, speak. Okay. We're all first to show shot on yeah. Now I'll show you this setup. Yeah. He's got a 50 odd hook on here. <laughs> yeah. What size is that? 12 odd. 12 odd. 12 odd. And you got? We got one, one 20 pound braid, swivel, three splits. Uh, I think this one's a demon dragon here. It might be. No, this is the Mad Cat's Battle Rattle on this one. Short piece of leader, 12 odd hook. And we're gonna put a piece of meat on to match it too. Yeah, good size. I mean, uh, he's down there, he's putting, he was putting like full size shads on there, yep. catching them, them ones down there. All right, try that again. Chicken breast. Yep, it's right, chicken breast. Yeah. <laughs> chicken breast, that's fun. as the hook open as possible. You don't want to fill that hook up on the field. And how deep are we? Uh, we are in <clears throat> nine and a half foot right now. Through the meat over there. We're chumming them already. <laughs> <laughs> I think he's hungry. <laughs> he come right in, man. <laughs> I think he, I, I thought this guy was ready to come on a boat. Look, he's right up the back of the boat here. <laughs> he's behind on the motor there. He's looking for some spares. It's pretty easy duck hunting down here. <laughs> man, no shit. Well, maybe maybe he's gonna be our good luck charm. I guess. I think he's gonna be our good luck charm. This is like. He's something ain't right with him. <laughs> yeah. 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 Yeah.
back and grab this. <laughs> that way you grab, you like slimy fish. <laughs> <laughs> There you go, fish on buddy. That's a blue. That's a decent one too. <laughs> you got to play them. Let me get these up and we'll get down here. Got a decent one on. Same route again, make sure it doesn't cross over the other one. Go away, channel cat. Usually I don't bother with channel cats checking their weight. You want know, this thing equal out. Okay. Little guy, stop. Pounder, 5.2 pounds. So I'm gonna jump in here real quick. So it gives me a reel that actually the handle is on the left hand side. Really weird, I know. And as I'm switching it for some reason, I am playing hell trying to get it back in, and I'm fighting it. And then you'll see how the chaos begins. You ever tried catfish cake? Yeah. I didn't think you would. <laughs> would I try it? Yeah. Yeah, I would try it. I, I didn't know if you ever tried makeup or anything like that. Or... It's actually pretty good. Eat salmon cake or anything like that ever? Yeah. Oh, Tim. Blue cat cake, thousand dollars per stamp cake. It 
Fish on. Fish on. He's got the reel apart. <laughs> he's got a fish on. He's, he's switching the handle out. Yeah. <laughs> with with a fish on running. <laughs> Here, you want to borrow this reel? <laughs> Get it in, devil, fix it. Oh, <laughs> drag on you, too. Blue cat, two and a half foot of water. small one decent one i figured they moved upstream because we're not running any water off the dam and it's that time of year where they're coming in to spawn so they will move up river don't want to come in yet two and a half foot deep and he doesn't want to come in and see us bring the tip in and we're in price is one of the days so far on Two pitchy. Twenty-two pound. Two and a half foot of water. You want to? Yeah, thirty. Thirty-one and a half. Thirty-one and a half. Mm-hmm. Okay. Right here, at the butthole. Now you should come out right about here somewhere, right at the back of the fin. You're gonna go. Yeah. Get in there. Okay. Go in. Down. Yeah. This knife's a little, a little tough on this on the boat instead of on my cleaning table. Nice chunk of meat up here, but that's you go this way, and I usually cut that out separate. It's just easier. It's easier than trying to work around this up here. Mm -hmm. That meat is so tough when he's fed. I think I'm gonna get them freaking uh, some more JL. I haven't got any, I'm gonna get some. Yeah. That skin's so tough that my good knife got swiped off my boot. Two flight knives the same day taken off my boot. Okay. All right.
set that there. Get this piece out quick. Obviously, you do a lot of these. <laughs> <laughs> Good bit. Good bit of them. And here we go. Clams. Yep, told you. These fish are full of clams. This is their main diet down here. Yeah. Yeah. So, now you have all that to hold to, just like that right there. Which makes it super, super easy. This is tough not having a picnic table. Usually, I like to take these and throw them in a five gallon bucket of water as I'm filleting them. Mm -hmm. Same here. And let them soak a little bit. I'll do that when I get home. I'll let them yeah. soak overnight. Yeah, let the, you don't even have to let them soak overnight. But it'll, uh, if you soak them in water, it'll let the fat come off of them. Yeah. Put this off. Don't want to leave any of this fat on there. None of that red meat. Yeah. Yeah. No merchandise or issues. Just add some fresh water to clean this. <laughs> We're going to do the pee pee dance because we both, <laughs> cause we both got to take a pee. <laughs> All right, so I want to thank Jim. Dan River Boys, he's got a new YouTube channel. He's just taking me out some catfish, and I think we did pretty good for today, but he said it was really slow. And so I, I think for today, we got some channel cats, and some blue cats, and I got some blue cats I'm going to fry home. So I'm going to tell you is wait for the next catch and cook. No, this is a catch and cook. Yeah. This is a goddamn catch it's and cook. It's going to end up being a catch and cook. It's catch, gonna be a catch, clean and cook. And cook. catch clean and cook. He cleaned, he did everything. I'm just going to cook it. All right, so I want to thank Jim for taking me out yep. um, catfishing today. And I'm sure I'm going to take him crabbing soon okay to teach him how to do he wants to see teach how everybody we, yeah teach try everybody to, out of trot line yeah so. do, do a trot line stuff like that from beginning to end and uh that's it so hey hey if you go to that video right there i'll show you how to cook snakehead on the blackstone all right thank <laughs> you for watching